In December of 1941, the United States entered World War II two years after it had already started. In November of 1942, the film Casablanca was released. This romantic yet political movie mainly focuses on the affairs of an American man named Rick. Throughout the film, Rick is a symbol for America. Casablanca sets this precedent by conveying that Rick is only concerned with himself and will only do what is best for him. This is displayed in the following scene. A very interesting club, especially so tonight, Major. In a few minutes, you'll see the arrest of the man who murdered your couriers. I expected no less, Captain. Monsieur Ugapi. Oh. La partie continue. Yes. Will you please come with us? Certainly. L'incident est clos, madame. May I first please kiss my chips? L'incident est clos, madame. La partie continue. Faites vos jeux, messieurs, mesdames. Va pour les jeux. La partie continue. Les jeux sont prêts. Pretty lucky, huh? <laughs> Two thousand, please. Two thousand. Thank you. Thank you. In this scene, there are multiple shots that emphasize emotions. For example, this is an over-the-shoulder shot that attracts the audience to Ugarte's emotions as he's appealing to Rick to help him. Then, as Ugarte is getting arrested, there's a single shot of Rick as he claims, I stick my neck out for nobody. Me, Rick, I hope you'll be more of a help. I stick my neck out for nobody. The single shot is meant to stress the importance of Rick's character and what he is claiming when he states how he does not want to get involved. Similarly, the United States did not want to join World War II when allies like Great Britain joined because of the foreign policy isolationism. This means that the U.S. would not get involved in foreign affairs but would stay neutral. It was not until Japan bombed Pearl Harbor when the United States joined the Allies' side. In other words, the U.S. did not get involved until Japan made a personal threat. In the end, Rick sticks his neck out for Ilsa when his personal interests are put on the line. Nine chances out of ten, we'd both wind up at a concentration camp. Isn't that true, Louis? I'm afraid Major Strasser would insist. You're saying this only to make me go. I'm saying it because it's true. Inside of us, we both know you belong with Victor. You're part of his work, the thing that keeps him going. If that plane leaves the ground and you're not with him, you'll regret it. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but soon and for the rest of your life. But what about us? We'll always have Paris. We didn't have, we, we lost it until you came to Casablanca. We got it back last night. In this scene, there are many close-ups which heighten the emotions and importance of the characters. The close-up magnifies the facial expressions of Laszlo, Ilsa, and Rick, which elevates their importance to indicate how Rick is a caring person and will put himself on the line when it comes to protecting things that are important to him, even if in the end he is losing the one he loves. Now, now. He's looking at you, kid. during the war, it was a turning point for the Allies. With this in mind, Casablanca is essentially conveying that when Rick, a symbol for America, gets involved with political affairs and finally picks a side, there is a major turning point in the movie as Laszlo and Ilsa, who symbolize the Allied countries, board the plane and Rick shoots Strasser, who is a symbol for Germany. This is essentially meant to mean that Rick is the driving force in Casablanca that helps America and the Allies gain the odds in winning the war over the Axis powers. The film conveys this message by utilizing historiography, which deals with the theory of history. Historiography is used by the film to emphasize to the audience what was occurring during the war. Since this film was released in the middle of the war, it was able to appeal to the audience because the war indirectly affected everyone. The film was invoking a nationalistic feeling by showing how an authoritative regime was threatening much of the Western Hemisphere by invading nations and brutalizing citizens. Thus, by using historical context and past events, Casablanca was able to appeal to the audience to take sides with Rick, which essentially meant that the audience wanted America and the Allies to win the war. Yes, I'm ready. Goodbye, Rick. God bless you. Gotta hurry, you'll miss that plane. <laughs>